What's up guys, so today we're gonna to do another Tinder takeover with a very interesting twist. We're gonna find out what is it like for a girl to message women as a guy. So Daddy's gonna be taking over my friend's profile and I'm gonna be giving my feedback to see whether her text game is on point. All right, so let's take a look at the profile we're gonna be using. So this is one of my friends, he's got a good little chef photo here, then he's got the suit photo, he's got this photo with his crazy chair, uh, him walking to the pool, him with the dumbbells. What would you rate this profile, one through 10? I would say a seven, seven out of five. I think looks wise he's like a six and, and profile is like a seven, so I agree, it's a decent profile. This is where you're gonna shine. So let's start off with some texting. So okay, start responding to some of these girls, Sophie. Yeah, she seems pretty cute. What okay, you what's your signature dish that you would use to win my heart over? That was him. That's my secret to give out when time comes. Oh, this is hard. But you like hard things, so you can do it. Okay, let's take a look. What's my secret, Tom? Because yeah, what do you think of this Tuesday? Yeah, the one mistake you made is you're you're trying to go for the hard close without first soft closing her. I always said, let's find out firsthand, uh, or we can find we can find that out over a date. So first you soft close the girl, then when she agrees to the date, then you figure out her schedule, then you hard close. So you kind of skip the closing steps and you went straight to the hard close. It can work, but it's less likely to work. Five minutes later. What do you think of this Tuesday? I'm not available this Tuesday. I have work event. I, I'm gonna say Bomber was looking forward to sharing a bottle of wine in my romantic balcony. I would rate the C minus. So what I would have said is said I'm not available this Tuesday, I have a work event. I would say, no worries, what night, what evenings are you free? So instead of like saying like, oh, too bad, we're not gonna get together, I would actually reframe and be like, okay, no worries, what evenings are you free this week, right? Because now we don't know if she's gonna respond to this or not. All right, let's move on okay, to the next let's one. Let's go with Ines. No worries, I understand as my life is crazy busy. Just got back from a run with my husky. How was your wild New Year's Eve? I, I like that. It was okay, ha ha ha, nothing crazy. How was yours? Okay, this is hard because he already told her how was his, right? Mm -hmm. Girls don't give like too much to work with. No, no, you don't say. <laughs> okay, I don't wanna be passive aggressive. So far, so good. I wanna give some type of SMV. You want to give some type of SMV? What does that even mean? No, what, what high value. DHV. <laughs> DHV. Oh, okay, it's so cringe. It's okay, nothing crazy. How was yours in the beginning of this year? So far, it's a good work. Hopefully, things get wilder this weekend. Yeah, it was fun. So, the first part is fun. Hopefully, things get wilder this weekend. I always said we should make things a little bit wilder this weekend, though. Or we should start off the new year with some fun, though. Or we should add some spice to 2023 for you. Something, okay. like, something like that. I think I'm getting better. Let's take a look at Rachel. You open with spicy cupcake. Hi, spicy cupcake. I was traveling out of town for the holidays and just got back. Hope you're not mad at me, spicy cupcake. Glad you like it. How was your New Year's? Mm, let's take a look. Yeah, I think that's fine. Uh, yeah, that's okay. I would rate that a B plus. See if you can get an A. Go okay. Yes, hosted a top floor party and had a private chef with friends and some family. How was your wild New Year's Eve? That's so fun. I went to Strawberry Moon. Sounds cool, but not sure what that is. It is a good time hotel or something. Laugh out loud. That sounds like fun. What do you think of meeting? Meeting, yes. Meeting for this new year. We can be adventurous together. Let's see. Yeah, it's a little bit too wishy washy. I would have said it's a good time hotel or something. I'd be like, cool. Anyways, you can tell me all about it over a drink sometime this week. All right, so moving things forward, instead of being wishy washy, like, oh, what do you think about maybe meeting sometime this year? Possibly. Is that okay with you? Oh no, the next God. one. That one I would wait to see. This one didn't reply. I'll re engage. How do you re engage? Um, I take you. I take you don't want to see. Take you don't want to see my Ryan Gosling move. Eh, I would not probably keep going with the meat gift thing. I would say a woman, a few words. I see. I just hit her with a takeaway. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Very well. How about you? Mine was pretty fucking magical. I'm gonna say take you are a woman, a few words. Mine was pretty fucking magical. Take you are a woman, a few words. Yeah, that's okay. What did I get there? I'll give you a B plus. B plus? You haven't earned the A yet. All right, let's see what your game is like on Tinder. Okay, so because it's Tinder, I think that I can sexualize a little bit more. So with Chantel, she goes like, hi there. I hope that 
2022 was amazing for you. I'm re-engaging here. Yeah, see, the problem is that this is a text that really there's not much she can respond to. She wouldn't be like, oh, yeah, right? So you always want to make things very easy and easy to respond there. I would, when she says hi there, I would say, well, shoot me your number so our romance doesn't die on the app. I would move okay. it off text given the fact that she hasn't been responding much. A lot of these girls do not give you a lot to work with. No shit. So this one is your dog and my dog should be. Are you supposed to see your dog and my dog should meet? Shoot me your number. Although I probably would not have gone for a number close off the off the response. Are you supposed to see sweet? I would have just said, don't think too hard now and re engage her with that. You don't want to ask for the number. Oh, wow. When the girl's not being responsive. It's too hard. There's only a way to find out. You look like right makes a fun and trouble. I'm very curious. Why don't you? Okay, this is a little douchey, but I Let's guess. Let's take a look. There's only one way from down there, Curious. Why don't you shoot me your number so it doesn't take me another year to reply? I mean, sure, that's fine. Again, you're kind of, you haven't re-engaged in a I'm while. A I would, there's only one way to find right? out. Eh, not douchey, but I would, there's only one way to find out. Then, like, indeed, just seeing your message now, shoot me your number or something like that. But yeah, yours is fine. I'll give this an A minus. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm making progress. I'm making progress. Okay, this vault chick. She's really hot. You look like you're right mix of fun and trouble. Hello, yeah. Can't believe I missed this. Still curious. Hello, yeah. Can't believe I missed this. Still curious. Why don't you shoot me your number so this won't happen again? Eh, yeah, again. I probably would not have gotten the number. She says, hello, yeah. I would have said, I'll take that as a positive. Or something like, I would, I would say, long time no talk. Uh, how you been, Val? Something like that. Basically, make a joke out of the fact that you haven't chatted in a while. This chick is a pretty cutie, though. Look at yeah, those. She's super look at those to taste. Let me just open some girls. You seem like the perfect combination. No, oh, where'd you get that opener from? Between sexy and cute. Yeah, that's fun. It's a standard opener that you see me use. Come up with something on your own based on the girls' photos. Okay, let's check out these girls' photos. Okay, I like France and Canada. I have a feeling that I would like you to. She's French Canadian. Have a freezing. Oh, okay. So poor grammar right there. <laughs> have a feeling, not freezing, that I would like you to. Like, You're I'm a man, you don't have the luxury of making gramma grammar mistakes, okay? Okay, this girl is just really attractive. So how would you engage her? Jim girl, you like Jim. You like the gym? I try to work out. Why don't we make it a date? Eh, that's okay. Although if she's far away, then there's no point. I guess that leaves us with Alicia. Let me see. The purple hair tells me you're fun. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a unique way of opening her. I will give you your first day for the day. Yay! <laughs> All right, so in conclusion, what do you think about using Tinder as a man? Um, girls do not engage much. So you have, I think that men are the ones who are having to carry the conversation. I found doing all the work, which is not very much fun, I guess. So what do you think we can do to make your woman engage? Trying to be funny. It's so, a way to stand out. Try to check the pictures and what you can open from them. I don't know, like, I don't think I did that well either way, so I think I'm in no position to- So overall, that. if you were a man, how do you think you would do? I think I would do- Virgin insult? I think I will not do that well, no. Mm, yikes. All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Show some love, like I always say, by smashing the like button, hit subscribe, click the bell for notification. Make sure you guys check out our brand new clips channel. We got a lot of interesting clips and highlights from the podcast on there. So don't forget to subscribe to that. Thank you guys for watching. Until next time.